So Jack met um, many people when he were here and I, I love the photo of him um, lined up there. He's got his, his cigarette um, and looking very dapper and the pearl merchants on each side. And it's been really fun to kind of work out who they all were and now for me to get in contact with the same families. So there were several pearl merchants that he met and he talks about in his diaries. It was Canoe, um, al Thakir, um, Mata and El Brahim. And, um, and it was really fun to, 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 as I say, to meet them 110 years later, for me to meet the descendants and for us to redo that photo. In fact, the problem in that photo was that they all looked very serious back in 1910, but we were having such a good time when we were taking the photo, it was very hard not to laugh and smile. Um, but that was really fun to, to reconnect the, the families um, over a century later. And I think, you know, here in Bahrain, the idea of family and the family, you know, generations of families, um, that closeness is also really important. So I think there's a kind of resonance with the family story here, which is lovely. But of course, obviously, the, the, those, those business links they made all those years ago and how important that was, I think, for, for both sides. Um, and, what a, and it was a relationship that, you know, started off as a business link, but it wasn't just business, it became more than that. Um, and I think there was a real respect and admiration between um, my ancestor and those he met. And I feel that that's, that's continued. So it's been, it's been really special for me.